Hello, we have some news today from Ripon in North Yorkshire. A intricately made silver ring has been declared treasure. This means that the person who found it on the 16th of May 2010 can benefit from its sale to public institutions um, as much as anyone else. So uh, it means that museums are, are able to bid for it and hopefully it will maintain its value as a piece of material history. Uh, as well as its intrinsic worth to the person who found it. This is yet another success story for the treasure trove uh, legislation and um, long may it continue. It's saving our archaeology from being lost to black markets. This particular ring is extremely interesting. It has uh, carnelianite, um, it has um, various inscriptions uh, such as words like live, uh, bear well and fear, which is interesting, or be well, and um, also as well is likely to have formed some sort of seal matrix for someone who wore it. So uh, this uh, is no doubt of interest to historians in the area and indeed um, has been deemed to be of archaeological significance. So um, very short, very small story, but it's just one of those things that makes you feel good about treasure trove uh, laws and legislation. It's working, it's helping people to get to benefit from their finds without having to go to the black market. And we get to benefit from their find as well. We get to go and see it in a museum. Uh, ultimately, um, that's the story for today. If you'd like to read a bit more about it, all you need to do is go to the link below. Uh, but on a separate note, I'd just like to say thank you to everyone for your birthday wishes. I had a wonderful weekend, and uh, yesterday we went to something called the Forbidden Corner, um, which is a fantastic place. If you ever get, get an opportunity, do, do, definitely go. Um, it's uh, it's kind of like Labyrinth. Um, Labyrinth, but without the... Um, uh, well, without David Bowie, actually, and his sock. Um, so, <laughs> once again, thank you for your birthday wishes. Um, I don't feel all that different, actually. 27, it's not, it's not, I haven't died yet, so that's good. I haven't, oh, I'm 27. As, as lots of um, certain people were saying, oh, you're, you're, you're over the hill now. So, um, no, no, I'm feeling good, and thank you once again. So, until next time, bye-bye.